It is time to brew your best beer. The 2016 SJ Pour Challenge is dedicated to your friend and ours, Paul Wickstein. Brought to you by Brewcraft USA. I make Gladfield Malting, Yakima Valley Hops, The Grain Bill, Brewers Exchange, Cake Kingdom Homebrew Supply. Iraqi Homebrew, and a special thanks to our silver sponsors. All right, just mowed the lawns right on dark, and um, I thought it was time for a beer. Get ready for Monday. Um, today it's the, or this evening, it's the Mystery Pale Ale. 52B, 96F, 85D, 4.2% ABV. No description online, so um, hey, it's a pale ale. Should taste like a pale ale. Right, um, let's get her opened. Been in the fridge for quite a while, but I've left it um oh good hiss out for the last half an hour. Should be a reasonable amount of aroma. Yep, getting a little bit of toffee off the nose. So it's pouring out um really nice colour. It's had quite a while to settle. This one is bottle conditioned. So I'm gonna be careful to keep the demons inside. Yeah, I'll just leave those there. So yeah, um, don't know if you can make out that, but there is um, a little bit of carbonation there. I'll just give it a bit of a swirl up. It's the beauty of these 330ml bottles. You can give it a swirl because the tide's out. All right, a little bit of a head that's um, come up there with a bit of gentle persuasion. Now for the aroma, um, not getting a huge amount of hops there, I'm kind of getting more um, malts, I'd say. Beautiful, clear, clear colour for a bottle conditioned um, beverage. My fluoro lights in the garage aren't doing it justice really, but there's a... Um, a really orange little laser beam on the side of the glass there. So anyway, I've had a nose, had a look, let's get a taste. There's a good amount of sweetness there. Um, yeah, not a huge amount of bitterness there um, for a pale ale. I'm really just mainly getting malts there. Yeah, it's really, really sweet. Um, could almost have a little bit more carb, um, just to kind of, um, I don't know, a bit of acid to that sweetness um, with the carbonic bite. It would would kind of help. It's a very clean beer. Um, cheers to the brewer. All right, back. Um, this beer had a very good body. It was um, some of the beers have been quite uh, thin for a low ABV, but this one managed to keep a very full body. Um, so you weren't kind of like um, wanting any more oomph. It was um, yeah, it was a, a sweet kind of um, action-packed beer. So um, yeah, maybe a few sort of like fermentation um, kind of issues, but um, overall. A well-built beer and um, cheers. Thanks a lot. See you next time. One more to do.